Have you ever wanted to convert your film negatives, slides, or prints to a digital format, but you don't want to spend lots of money? SVP has released two scanners to help clean up your collection in a way that helps you save money and time. The PS9700 and the FS1800 are the perfect solution for all of your scanning needs. The PS9700 is an all-in-one scanner that combines every tool that you'll need to help digitize and preserve your photos forever. It even scans 35mm film negatives so it'll save you a trip to the Photoshop. Here's how it works. First, plug your USB into the USB port. The power supply for the scanner either comes from the computer through the USB port or through the AC adapter. The next step is to insert your SD card. You are now ready to scan your print. Choose either a 5x7, a 4x6, or a 3x5 print for your scan. Be sure that your switch is set to photo scan as well as your slide. Slide your photo into the back of the unit. Press the scan button to scan your image and then press the enter button to save your image. It's that easy. I bought the PS9700 because my parents had tons of negatives they had never had printed. We didn't even know it was on the film anymore. I figured for the price of scanning the hundreds of negatives, it'd be worth it to purchase the scanner and I couldn't have been more impressed. I was able to sort them on my computer and save them to CDs. Don't have any prints to scan? That's fine. Try the FS1800 to scan just slides or negatives. We had an old projector that broke down years ago, and so all we had left over was a showbox full of slides. We never replaced the projector. So when I saw an ad, I thought now would be the perfect time to get those slides scanned and saved. I'm so glad we did. I work out of my home as a freelance photographer. I have customers who ask me if I repair old photos. I used to turn them down because it used to take up so much of my time. But now I've heard how easy the PS9700 was and now I can scan photos quickly with high quality and edit them using photo editing software. It was a very small but worthwhile business decision on my part. So there you have it. If you're trying to preserve your photos in a cost-effective way, you have to try the PS9700 or the FS1800.